might be celebrating a first successful festive season in Wolf Wood, but down in Tiger Territory, this could be a last Christmas. The park's much-loved tiger cubs, Rusty and Yuki, are turning into teenage tearaways. They're almost ready to stretch their paws, which may mean they're not around for festivities next year. First-time parents, Yana and Red, are part of a vital breeding program to protect the endangered Amor species. And last year, they gave the park the ultimate gift of tiger cubs for the first time in 20 years. She's given oh, birth. Ah, oh, it's moving. Put this little cub name straight away. We followed their story from the very start. And during that time, Rusty and Yuki have captured the hearts of guests and keepers. Oh, oh my gosh! But none more so than Caleb's. Watching these tigers grow is fantastic. Um, you know, I've seen them pretty much every day, and um, they are the most incredible animals. They're always trying to cause trouble. They're always being naughty, stalking each other, hunting each other. They are approaching 18 months now, um, which in tiger terms means they're getting really big. But it's not just their size that's changing, it's their behavior too. Mum Yana realizes her cubs are relying on her less and less. And Caleb's noticed her instincts have shifted significantly as she sees her cubs becoming more independent. It's a real turning point for her as a mum and the keepers as the cubs come of age. She knows that she's done her job and she knows that she's raised two very confident, capable tigers. Um, and I think she's just reached a stage where she's like, they can survive on their own, so I'm going to concentrate on myself and then potentially having another litter, because she does show a lot of kindness and friendliness towards Red, and those two have a very special bond, so I think she is keen to go back with Red. You can let the tigers go, Rachel. Not tigers are on there. Come on. In the wild at this age, the cubs would begin fending for themselves. To see if it's time for Rusty and Yuki to fly the nest, Caleb is setting up a test. We've got Yuki out. A year ago, Yana was very protective whenever she was separated from them. If she's happy to let them go, it shows the cubs really are growing up. So currently we've got the cubs out, but Yana's not interested at all. And it seems Caleb's instincts are spot on. By staying behind and not making a fuss, the keepers are certain that Yana's happy to be reunited with Red and ready to see the cubs make their own way in the world. They've reached that age where they're not reliant on her and she's happy to just let them go out on their own. For the park and the keepers, this is a real milestone. Rusty and Yuki can now move on to other collections where one day they'll hopefully have cubs of their own as part of the vital breeding program. And Yana and Red can reunite and maybe produce another litter here at the park. It is quite sad watching them grow up um, because they were so small and so sweet and now they've obviously grown into to teenage tearaways. Um, but I think they still have the same personality so we still love them as much as we did when they were tiny fluff balls. And actually it's really good because they are going to potentially go off to have cubs of their own and, and sort of our job as keepers for these guys is almost done um, when they do reach maturity. And obviously the closer they are to moving on, the closer we are to having more tiger cubs if we're allowed to. So yeah, they're still amazing. I still love them to pieces. But days later, Caleb and the other keepers have to brace themselves. Uh just as they thought it was time for the cubs to fly the nest. It's clear Rusty is poorly and he needs his mum. Rusty's normally full of life, he's full of energy, he's running around, um, and he is the polar opposite of that. He had no energy this morning. And th he seems to be looking off into the distance, which is a sign that there could be some pain there as well. The keepers now have a battle on their hands to ensure this endangered Amor tiger pulls through.